Welcome to Bob's Training Liquid Solution. Uh, sorry again for not updating for a long, long time. So get quite busy with work, and also we have received quite a amount of mock interviews. Uh, of course, include uh, including non-Chinese students. Um, pretty much everyone took it uh, like as very useful because we can you know point out the red flags you never actually realize yourself. You might be just keep interviewing, and then you'd be like, oh, why am I still feeling I solved all the technical problems all. Or why I'm still not getting an offer. So maybe even you are not even you, know, you 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 put some red flags of the interviewer and then they throw you at the question, they don't even care anymore anymore. It's like yeah, you can solve it or not solve it, but you know, this is a easy question. Even if you solve it, you'll be like, Hey, it's okay. Anyway, um just like usual, feel free to uh, you know contact us. This is our WeChat blog, we will be posting some very useful interview related articles. Uh, unfortunately all of them are still in Chinese. And uh, um, but for mock interviews, feel free to shoot us an email at uh, browser training. Um, you know, do you have it? Yeah, browser training at outlook dot com. Uh, we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Okay. Um, okay. So let's solve a question today. So here's the question for today. It's called the bad first bad version. Um, so you know they wrap up the problem in a way that is uh, basically it's a sorted array. Each is an integer. Uh, it's a con consecutive as well and we represent it as a version number and uh, uh, you want to find out first the bad one which causes the following ones to be bad so the assumption is as long as you have a bad one so the following ones are bad and then you they want you to find the first bad one and uh, assuming you have an api to call so you give an integer you can call this api and uh, implement the function to find the first bad version right um so oh by the way i will start using python because you know i post all my questions in java and a lot of your feels like um, they want to try to learn some Python, and uh, there we go. Um, mm -hmm. I'm 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 pretty new to Python as well. So basically, the Python code I'm writing is more like uh, like you know, not very Python-ish. Um, so I'll improve along the way. So essentially, the problem is like let's say if you have one, two, three, four, five. So those are n equals to five. You want to find the first. Uh, bad version number. So let's say uh, two is the two is the first bad one. Right? So a very easy way, that means after two everything is bad and one is one is true. So you can just call it linearly. So that will result in an O N algorithm, but they apparently they want to do the better. And as as long as you see something sorted, the uh, first impression is can I do binary search? Yes you can, right? So you will be like, hey first I'll check three, three returns bad. And it's okay. I I, I should still pushing to the left because it's a bad one and if it's three okay so we're pushing to the left so now we have one and two so in this case um so we'll we'll still push it to one so one is a true in this case so as long as we see a true we want to find the first the rightmost true as we still have to push to the right as long and then in this case it's two so two it doesn't mean anything to bad or two so your termination uh action will be your left should be larger than right that means it will cross the boundary so as long as this happens um, so you will you will check okay so in this case you will because it 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 wants you to find the first bad one right so that means your right is definitely is gonna be true uh, that's why you're in this state so right plus one will basically be your the first bad one um, uh, anything else oh a tricky part is you want you may want to check it so for example if all of them are still bad. But you know this. This is a good, very uh, clarification question to ask with your interviewers. What happens if everything is is good? So you, you just need to check the last element, right? If it's, it's a good one, that means yeah, there's no bad version. So what would you return? Throw exception or do something else? Uh, okay, so let's do it. First of all, I'm actually quite curious. So why Python? Like normally, if you follow uh, pip eight, right? So this should be method name should be all snake case instead of uh, uh, camel case. But anyway. Not important. Um, okay, so let's just uh, do some coding with so this. I don't know. Um, let's just raise exception. And. Um, So if what they call it is bad version, and 
it is still not that version right? so okay. now what is do our normal binary search type of thing right just as before so this is just like our um java code so in this case i'll define output which takes in a left and the right so um yeah you want to say left is a uh, something like that it's okay but just I feel like because it's you know, I'm so used to you know strong typing, so for weak typing type of thing, especially in large project, is also very helpful. But of course, your ID, whatever you use, then Emacs or Python, they'll give it to you yeah, for free. So here we just add an example. Um, so yeah, it's like this. So all you want to return is actually because you left is already larger than right, right? So the only way you can do this position is your right one previously is already a true. So that's why. You, you were coming to it could it could be coming from from left to right or from right to uh to left um so we just want to return right plus one and this is just as what what we did before. Really need it. If mid is a bad version, I right? think about it. If this is a bad version, so you actually want to keep calling. This one. So this, if if this is the last one, right? So if it. This is a better version to keep pushing it to the left, and then left is actually larger than right, and then you will just return because that one is uh, pretty much the, the first one. Else, so if it's not a bad version, we'll just uh, keep finding because this is true, we'll want to keep finding the bad one. Okay, this looks correct to me. Error, okay, the logo name helper is not defined. Mm -hmm. Twenty-seven. Uh, okay. So in this case, it will be a, a login type of uh, um, complexity because we're doing binary search instead of linear search. The login type of uh, comparison uh, calling the is bad version. No attribute helper. Where did I say that? Helper. Oh, it's not, wrong answer. Okay. Why the first bad version? So you have only one. Output now. If you only have wait a second, one version, one is the first bad version. Huh. So if, if you don't have, have one, so okay, that is fine. So one is better version. It's true. Should not raise, man. Eh? One, one. One. Okay, wait a second. Input one. Version. This is bad version. 
is true. Suppose you have n versions and you want to find out the first bad version. Expect it should be one, right? This bad version. Ha, ah, what the heck? Didn't return anything. Okay, this looks good at this moment. Um, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.